Well, now that the winter seems to be upon us, some time ago I bought a Winnowell fast fold oven. It weren't cheap, but we're going to get that out in our shack and uh, do a little bit of a cook up because sitting in the house in the winter is fine, but it's nice to sit in your shed, isn't it, after all? Right, well, let's get it unboxed. We love an unboxing on Amazon in this house. What's in the box? As I said, I bought this months ago, but then it turned to summer. A piece of cardboard. Some instructions. And here we have the paper. Let's turn this over and put it on there. Is it really going to be this easy? Rather splendid scrap arrangement. Do you honestly just lift this up? No. So here are all the relevant parts. Oh, you do. You fold that out, you fold that out, that's the door. How does that work? Stop it together first. I like this one. Metal trays inside, and you've got the doors fold out like that, and presumably clip in thus. It's really quite easy, and all that annoyingly won't shut. Oh, it does shut quite easily. Then that goes in there, and this opens like that and you just push that to a little bit of the doors whoops we're fumbling one-handed job push it in a little out a bit like that that goes like that if you hold that winner well is a very good company they um So inside, you've got this on the bottom there. And that's how you get your heat through. Interesting. Very interesting, that. Huh? And then these are your shelves. So they go in there. That shelf. How many doors you want to put that in? Think it's in goes in there and then the lid oh remove that we don't want that on there lid plonketh on if thusly this winter well stuff is made up but it is expensive that goes on like that and then it goes in there in there, and there you have your winner well campsite oven to put on, a, on, on some sort of burner, you know, a normal log burner or a hot tent burner. Do they want tightening? I don't know, I don't think so. Yeah, there we are. The winner well burner. We'll go and get that on the go now and cook up something. Don't know what, but it'll be something. All right, so we're just lighting up Puff and Billy down in the old. Uh, of a hole and when doors is down there bought me a side see we've got ourselves something weird what's that slow gin slow gin what's that hell of a lot i thought you could share it yeah boy and there we is the old winter well stove got a bit wet coming down it's got a temperature thing on it i'm using those wood wool things to get it lit little stinks out down there isn't it come in all we'll grub about in the wet <laughs> right let's see oh, how I this really? goes come in here poppy Come on, in. She's grabbing about now. She's grabbing about it now. Right, let's see how this goes. Get a lid. So as you can see, we're not using this with the correct stove. We were using it with the original Outbacker stove, but you can only see that the temperature's starting to rise. It's got some sort of gauze in there. Um, but let's heat in there quicker. Interesting little latch. You just do that, and the gauze is in there, look. So we're just going to do some sausages and bacon today and we're going to have sausage and mash. The mash will be cooked in the house. 
Yeah. I've had this a long while, only no use. But we'll probably take it on a camp or two. Bit of fun. Well, the temperature is rising quite nicely. I think it's about 150, 160 degrees C. That's not been on long, so this is quite good. So back time to put the sausages in. Now indoors is coming. With the sausages, is she coming? Through the wet and windy squall. I can't see her, but she's coming, I think. Yeah, that's her, look. Got the sausages in hand. So the sausages are in, and the wind is getting up out there. Don't know why we're sitting in a shed. Why are we sitting in a shed, Owen Doors? Because you're nuts, you're nut nut. I'm a nut nut, apparently. So, so far it's been on about 15 to 17 minutes and the sausages are starting to cook well. The temperature now, it's not getting up to where I'd like it, but it's good enough. I'm not sure if that will boil the water. Who knows, it's going to be very slow, but it might. Of course, that'll be taking the heat away from the oven, but what do I care? Time is not pressing on me, fortunately. With this winter wellies, you can just pick it up with a thing and bring the whole oven up. And there are the sausages. They're not um, quite crisp, but they're oven cooked and they're certainly done. Yep, please, that's a sausage in there. Right, and to take it down, hopefully that's your simple thing. You just undo these on the side, which are four of. Take off the lid, take out the grills, they're all very clean for the sausages. Take out the grills, um, and then just to undo the hooks on the side, which is these hooks here, there, and there. Drop that in, drop that in. Uh, perhaps it goes the other way actually. Sometimes these have got offset hinges. Or oh, the sides go in first. No, they don't. They won't go in first. Then the sides go down. That goes down, I think. Oh, well, I've got to put the bit in the side, I reckon. We do have instructions with this to show how to have it. Come on, those things. Set those down. Set them. Right. Instructions to fold it, and it will go nicely. You fold that bit first. You make sure these bits are out of the way. Then that bit goes down, and that will go flat. Then you then you can put your grapes in. then this bit goes and if you just dip it at the side that will go flat then this bit goes in and you have to be careful and make sure that they go over the right bits and already it's wrong right in order to fold this there is a specific way so if you take the lid off and you fold that one down first you make sure these bits are out of the way of this bit, of that bit there. You fold that down. Then you can put your grates in. Like that. Then you put the, the glass one over. Curiously, you turn the door so it's holding it there. So it's not locked. If it's locked, it won't fit. Then you put this bit down. It's going flat, so it's pretty flat now. Then you put the lid on. Thus, and then you put the strap around it with the velcro. That's how it finishes up with the velcro around it, like that. Um, I don't know if it's completely right, but it seems to work. I'm going to put it in the box, but we have bought a bag. You didn't get a bag with it. They're 25 quid. You can get them from the Winnemar website. So the last postal man bought the bag today, which we bought for the uh, oven. 25 quid delivered, though, but it is very good quality. So, yeah, the folder oven can go in there, which uh, I'm pleased with. Yeah, right, there it goes, fits in there well. Worth buying, should have been included, something like that, but there. Yep, good, lovely, thanks for watching.